In this tutorial, we will see the target attribute of the anchor tag. When we want to open a link to a specific website, normally we can specify the place or the windows where this link will be opened in a browser. And this can be done to the target attribute of the anchor tag. As you can see in this example, we have created five links, which contains all the values of the target attribute. Let's test now one by one and see what each one does. If we open the browser, here we have the links. So let's see, the first value is the value blank. If you click on the first link, this opens the document in a new windows. The next value of this attribute is the value self. If we click on this link, the document will be opened in the same windows where the link has been clicked. Now the best way to explain the following three values of the target attribute, the parent, the top and the frame name will be by using frame set and frame stacks. But I would like to mention also that this frame set is not supported in HTML5. So what I have done, I have created a document which has a frame set tag that contains three frames and each one points to a separate HTML file. That's the frame 1, that's the frame 2 and that's the frame 3. This document in which we are right now will be the frame, the parent frame. Now this is the frame 1, this is the frame 2 and this is the frame 3. The frame 3 contain all the links to be able to test the values of the target attribute. Here is another illustration to be able to understand how these frames within the frame set tag works. Now let's test the links which are located in the third frame. So let's make this window bigger and let's test all the attributes inside of this frame set. So if we click in the first link, this will open in a new windows. So let's test it. As you can see, this is opening in a new windows. Let's close that. N go to the next. If you click on this one, this will open in the in the same frame. As you can see here, we have it in the same frame open it. Okay, let's test the third one. This will open in the parent frame. So it will be in the same windows, big windows. As you can see, this is opening in the parent frame set. Okay, the, the fourth one, the top one, is it's similar to parent, which is opening in a top level browser, a uh, top level frame. So if we click on that, we'll open in the top one frame, in the in a top frame, like in a parent frame. So what that means, if there are more top, more level levels of frame, this will be opened in the parent, the first parent, yeah, so the top one. Okay, now let's test the last one. So this last one, we can uh, specify which frame within the list of the frames will be opened. So how can we identify this is by the name attribute. So if we do name uh, and we do the value, uh, in this case te test for example, we can specify that this will be the identifier target where this will be opened. Let's refresh the page and if we click that, we will see this frame, it's identified by the name attribute. So let's click on that and as you can see, this is open it in the specified frame. So this is how this target attribute works in HTML frame stacks.